Hey, this is Brett. Hope everybody's having a great day out there today. And this 2019 Honda Odyssey EXL is stock number 14583ZAA. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used minivan and SUV headquarters. This 2019 Honda Odyssey EXL has the 3.5 liter V6 engine. It puts out 280 horsepower, 262 foot-pounds of torque. It's paired up with a nine-speed automatic transmission. This Honda Odyssey has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. It has brand new tires, brand new brakes, and it is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video inside start it up take a look under the hood show you all the options and give you the most accurate representation that i can of the vehicle pacific pewter metallic is the color paint code is br shoot all my videos in 4k if you like the video subscribe to the youtube channel click the bell notifications get updates in the videos i do each and every day as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on youtube Stay current on our ever-changing and vast inventory here at Summit Automotive. This one comes with the 18-inch painted silver alloy wheels. They're in really nice condition, no major scuffs or scrapes on there. You can see we did do brand new brakes in the front in our safety inspection, and we also put brand new Laughlin S-Fit AS tires. These are 23560R18s. They still have the little knobs on the top from being brand new and the lines on there. And like I said, we put those on in our safety inspection. Now there are a bunch of miles on this vehicle, but it is a one owner, clean title history, clean Carfax from right here in Wisconsin. And for the age and miles on it, it is in really nice condition. That's what I'm gonna convey in this video, or try to anyways. No major dents or dings or cracks on that front bumper. Headlight lenses are nice and clear. The hood is in pretty nice shape. Didn't see any major dents or dings does have a couple little scratches and stuff and everything is not perfect on this van but it is mechanically sound and the body is in really nice condition passenger side front wheel no major scuffs or scrapes on there pacific pewter metallics got a lot of metal flake in it really a good looking color and the paint for the most part is in really nice condition on this vehicle like I said, there are a couple little scratches and scuffs and stuff, but nothing too bad. As you go down this side of this 2019 Honda Odyssey, take note of how clean the body is. Once again, no dents or dings, very nice shape down the side. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by, you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the van, hear the van, and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises, and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful, and that Brett sent you. Back wheel's in excellent shape. You can see the back brakes are brand new as well and the back tires are brand new too. So brand new brakes and tires all the way around on this vehicle, which is really nice. Couple little scuffs on the rear quarter that must have just backed into something. No accidents on the Carfax though. Uh, rear bumper other than that is in pretty nice shape. I didn't see any major cracks or scuffs on there. And the rear gate is in really nice condition as well. It does have a couple little scratches up top here and that's typically from people opening it with their garage doors not fully closed or fully open. A back storage area, you get a max liner, all weather floor mat back here. Third row seats, those are, are manual fold down. So they go down like so. You can also put them into the floor like that. And you can see just how nice and flat they go. And then to get them back up, just put them like that, grab this strap, and it'll go into place. They do have Velcro there to keep those straps up. Does have a subwoofer back here and power outlet. To get this gate down, you press this button right here, and it comes down nice and smoothly. Shut solidly, and as you go down the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, no major dents or dings on the rear quarter or door. And for full disclosure, this back wheel, just about as nice shape as the rest. Does have just a couple little scuffs there. Um, nothing too bad. 
going down the rest of the side of the van. Doors look really good. You do get power mirrors with directional signals. These mirrors are heated as well. Let's take a quick look at these second row seats. You can see that power sliding door is working nicely. In the second row here, you get this kind of brown leather seating. Uh, obviously, you get the center seat. I believe that seat comes out. It is removable. And these, uh, these side seats might even be removable as well. I'm not too well versed in my Honda Odysseys. Uh, latch child safety system for any child car seats you may have. Let me know in the comments below if you can take these side seats out. Be interesting to know. Two USBs, cup holders there. You get your rear air controls and you get the uh, window shades in here as well. So these seats go forward really easy to get to that third row. You get all weather floor mats back here in those third row seats. No rips, no tears back here. You get the side window antenna and then you get cup holders back here as well. Everything is very nice and clean, smells very clean inside this van. And to get this door closed, you press the button right there. Up front, the EXL package gives you these same brown leather captain's chairs. Both of these front seats are heated. I believe they're both power as well. Side curtain airbags, no rips, no tears. And you get max liner all weather floor mats up here as well. You get forward collision warning, lane departure, stability control, uh, rear gate opener, side door opener, tilt telescopic steering wheel, power windows, locks and mirrors, and a memory driver's seat. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this one has to offer on the interior. You can see that instrument cluster starts up and it's fully digital. And this van does have 120,396 miles. Personally, I think for the miles on this van, it is in really nice shape, um, especially with the mechanical stuff we just did to it, digital speedometer and outside temperature display, and that instrument cluster is very nice and clean. Comes with the leather-wrapped multifunction steering wheel, adaptive cruise controls, regular cruise controls, lane departure warning, uh, Bluetooth information center controls, and you get paddle shifters on there as well. Push button start, you get the Honda touchscreen radio. It does have Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, which is really nice because this one doesn't have the factory navigation system, but you can project your cell phone up there with Waze or Google Maps, and it's like you have nav right in the screen. You get all those different apps on there, including Honda Link, AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. And uh, yeah, really nice touchscreen radio. Everything is working nicely. Dual climate controls. Uh, rear air controls as well, your heated seat buttons, snow mode, eco mode, and this is your transmission where you shift it into drive and everything, and your heated seat buttons. Keyless entry with remote start and power lift gate. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition, no rips or tears on there, and it does have the power sunroof up front. You get map lights right there, sunroof controls as well as home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems in the mirror and it is an auto dimming mirror. Let's start it up and take a look under the hood and check out the lights in front. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. But more importantly, hopefully you were able to verify the quality, condition, options, and of course cleanliness of this van all the way around inside and out. All the lights are working very nicely. And under the hood, we have the 3.5 liter V6 engine, 280 horse, 262 foot-pounds of torque. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth, and once again this van has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. There is the emissions sticker. Four brand new tires, brand new brakes, all the way around. And this van is 100% ready to go. I would highly recommend it. Once again, for the age and miles um, and condition, it's in really nice shape, especially with the mechanical stuff we did. And to see more pictures of this van or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, 
You can go to youtube.com slash Summit Auto, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and minivan walkarounds on YouTube and stay current on our ever-changing and vast inventory here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Honda Odyssey vans I've done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. And we are super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2019 Honda Odyssey EXL 8 passenger in Pacific Pewter Metallic. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again, and have a great day.